Hey guys, Mike here, and today we're going to be doing a drum overhead shootout between the Warm Audio 87, the Neumann KM184, and the Audio Technica 4040. Let's get started. All right, guys, you can see we're all set up now. Um, got my Mapex Pro M here. I love this kit. I got it back when I, um, in 2004, when I got back from Iraq. So it's, uh, I'm dating myself, I know that, but it's it's pretty old, but I love this kit. It's been on tour with me. It's been across the country. It's beat the crap, but I love it. Um, check out down below. I'll leave in the description all of the specifics about what's on this kit, the sizes, the types of symbols, and all that kind of stuff. We're going to be running for all the drum comparisons to the same preamps. I got Focusrite ISA 110s or 110s, whatever you want to call them. Uh, so we're going to make sure that it's a level playing field for all the mics. Up first is the Warm Audio 87s. I have them padded to minus 10, and also I have them set to cardioid. They do have the Infinity and the, um, the room mic settings on them, but these for this comparison, I'm going to have it set to cardioid. Uh, so let's get started. I'm excited. All right, guys, let's give the Warm Audio 87s a run. All right, as you can see, we're now set up with the KM184s made by Neumann. This is a stereo match set. Um, it's my favorite set of microphones that I have. They um, they just sound great on any acoustic instruments. They got a slight bump in the, the 9, uh, 9,000 hertz range, so it gives a little bit of brilliance, but they got great 180 degree rejection. They're frequency independent, and they can handle 138 dB before they uh, distort. So just a really great set of microphones. Let's check them out. All right, set back up, ready to play. Let's check out these KM-184s. All Okay, so last up we have the Audio Technica 4040s I have up on the stands behind me. Um, these were the first set of large diaphragm condenser microphones that I got from my studio, and they have been such a workhorse for me over the years. Uh, I've used them on drums, guitar, piano, strings. Um, they're, they're just a really great transformerless, smooth sounding microphone. So for the price point, these guys are incredible. Let's check them out.
right, so there you have it. Please leave me a comment below. Let me know what you heard. The Neumanns definitely had the most depth and organic feel to me out of the three, but of course they were by far the most expensive microphone um, that I put up today. The Warm Audios and the Audio Technicas held their own as large diaphragm condensers. I think all three sets of mics would just be great options for any record that you're trying to make. So uh, stay tuned for future videos. Can't wait to make another one like this and take care, guys.